She eats lots of stuff. Anything? Just about anything. This is a time when kids are spending five to six hours a day on their screens. They can identify a thousand corporate logos, but they can't identify 10 plants in their yard or 10 plants anywhere so in a picture. It's, um, it's very sad. We've been studying the impact of gardening since 1982 and very closely since 2005. And with all of our grant winners, what we learn is that gardening changes kids' worlds for a lifetime. Yeah, your heart is a sun and it's shining. What's your name? Kippy. Is it She's a girl. Yeah, you could pet. It's so soft, right? <laughs> so the Budding Botanist Grant was created in 2018 with Kids Gardening. And it's a really great partnership because they are a nonprofit foundation who's the leader in bringing learning and gardening to children and to schools across the country. We offer six grants uh, worth $3,000 each. And this year, in 2019, we chose to choose Renaissance Charter School. We need to really become one with gardening and nutrition and educate the young children of today to really become stewards of the environment and learn and then hopefully bring that education into their own private lives, then even further educate their parents and have it become part of um, an integration into their livelihood. Is that your chicken? Oh, look at that, so great. So I'm here at the Budding Botanist Program at the Renaissance Charter School with Chloron, and they just gave a grant to this school to upgrade their garden here on their rooftop. And they have this cool little greenhouse, and they're doing all their seed starting in here and then they transplant the plants outside of the greenhouse in their raised beds. And they also build all these little boxes for birds. While visiting the school, Kippy and I led the release of ladybird beetles for the kids to enjoy and to learn about the importance of beneficial insects. Hey guys, so you're about to release some really awesome bugs right now. And as you found out, these are ladybugs. And when they make little babies, their little larvae, which is their stage before they get to this stage, which is this nice little beetle stage, actually is the most hungry of all of the bugs. And even their babies will eat bad bugs. So the adults and the babies actually eat bad bugs, which is super cool because we don't eat bad bugs, right? No, why would we want to eat bad bugs? We're not animals. <laughs> But these guys want to eat the bad bugs. And Kippy doesn't even like ladybugs. She wants to eat, she wants to eat mealworms, the things that live underground in the dirt. But she finds these interesting, don't you? So she is gonna help you release these guys. So who's ready to release some ladybugs? Yay! Yay! Okay. I'm so scared. Don't be scared of just that ladybugs don't yeah. harm anybody. Well, I, I have Oh, whoops, a lot. <laughs> I'll start picking them up. <laughs> yeah, you can pick it up. Perfect! That was great! Yeah, Kippy! Good job, Kippy! Good job, Kippy! Kippy. Kippy. Such a star. <laughs> she is a star. I'm a star! <laughs> To learn more about the Budding Botanist program, visit chloronusa.com slash buddingbotanist.